what I typically do is I go into my uh, console here, right? I go to the top level and we'll clear this out. And then I go wp.data, data, right? And then I look for whatever, like I look for the store. You probably can't read that. So this is a great way of like, so if we go for the core store, for example, right? So you can see what all the selectors are. Right, you can see what's available to all of them, which is pretty handy. We can do it this way, and it's kind of it's kind of annoying, right? Um, but so what I did was I built this thing, five coded it a little bit. It's an extension, and the idea behind this extension is twofold. What I want to be able to do is I want to be able to come in here and say I want to use dispatch, and I want it to pick the store that I I, I want to use. So let's use core, and then when I come back in here, so now I can destructure out. I have to do that, I think. I, have to d I, I can destructure out all the items that I want, right? So I can do do another one, right? So this is gonna match with what's in that store. Other I, thing is that I, I also wanna be able to do it on the select, right? So if I do this, I have to figure out some of the stuff. Okay, so now I can go in here and I can get whatever I need. So get ed entity, for example. So that's the first part. The second part is that I have this little data stores uh, do that in here. So now you can go in here and, and you can inspect all the selectors and it's, it's more, it's just an inventory at this point. Is this something that people would find helpful? Let me know and I would definitely be happy to share.